What is up, everybody? Time has flown by over the last year, hasn't it? Yes, it has been one full year since my last video. 2021 was crazy, crazy, crazy to say the least. Uh, but once again, I am back. If you're new here to the channel, obviously you didn't miss me. And that's all right. So make sure you subscribe, hit that like button for me. My name is Drake Pfizer with DSF Financial, showing individuals like yourself the ATM business and how I'm making my money work for me through passive income. Yes, time has flown by. I had a lot going on in 2021, as I'm sure a lot of you guys did, and I personally did not have the time and honestly the energy to make videos, uh, but some things have changed. As some of you guys know, I am a general manager of a hotel by day and an ATM owner and operator by night. With COVID unfortunately still around, 2021 was wild. In the hotel business, obviously COVID, hit the hotel hospitality industry very, very difficult or very, very hard. And uh, I was, as a general manager, the one that uh, was leading in all of the efforts and making sure things were going smoothly in the day-to-day -day operations of the hotel. As I'm sure you can imagine, most businesses uh, had, to, had to adapt and uh, improvise the best way possible to fight COVID to try and survive just in terms of staffing, which staffing is very, very difficult. Uh, also in terms of uh, just people traveling, not as many people are traveling now, uh, which obviously puts a huge burden on the hospitality industry. If people aren't traveling as much, people aren't using hotel rooms. Some of you also may know I was a dual property general manager, meaning I was a general manager for two hotels. Uh, call me crazy, but halfway through 2021, in July, I actually took on a third hotel. Yes, three hotels I was a general manager of. I was in charge of a complex of hotels. Now, if you can imagine all the issues, uh, all the things to overcome, all the problems to resolve in one hotel, multiply that. I was doing that by three. Now, in terms of all the craziness that can happen, I'm sure you can imagine it gets crazy and boy, oh boy, it did. I really did learn a lot last year running the three properties and, and as crazy it was, I honestly wouldn't have changed it. As I try and advertise in the videos, I definitely live by it. I do not stay stagnant. I do not stay still in anything I do. And the hotel industry was, uh, was no different. I wanted that responsibility of three hotels and it definitely was a lot. Now with making videos, it does take some time and effort to do, like I've mentioned before, and I honestly just didn't have the energy to do it. Um, any type of extra energy that I had, I was using it uh, to get ready for the next craziness that happened in the hotel and just no videos uh, were being made. Now I also own a house in Austin, which uh, sometimes I do have to do maintenance on it. Just like the ATM business, I try and do everything myself in terms of fixing things, in terms of running things. So some things happened last year. We had an AC obviously go out, which seems to be a yearly thing. So we're expecting that with our 21 year old AC. But what isn't normal is freezing pipes. I don't know if you guys remember, but in uh, February of last year, Texas, all of Texas, uh, Southern Oklahoma got hit very, very hard with a very hard freeze and snowstorm and it essentially shut the state down. Uh, once all of the craziness happened, which obviously craziness at the hotels happened, but once the ice ended up melting, unfortunately, a lot of people's houses did have plumbing issues. Uh, my house here in Dallas area, it uh, actually did very, very well. Um, so no issues there, but our house in Austin did not uh, get so lucky. Once everything defrosted and the ground kind of thawed out a little bit, we found out that the main water line into the house did have a leak in it, the pipe cracked, and of course it cracked right under a tree. So we had to take a trip down to Austin to fix that pipe, and it was a job. Shout out to Jonathan for hooking us up with someone to help uh, help the hard labor of it. We did end up having to chop down the tree, dug it all out, 
had to dig about three feet deep into the ground. Luckily, it was sopping wet, so it wasn't hard to dig, but there was a lot of mud, which definitely has its own issues as well. But after a full day of work, uh, we were able to fix that pipe and uh, everything was back to normal. As a homeowner, you have to make sure that the tenant is 100% satisfied. And if he isn't able to run water or if his water bill is skyrocketing because there's a pipe that busted, I got to make sure to fix that. I got to make sure to make that right. So that's what, uh, that's what we did. Now the ATM business, uh, it unfortunately did stay stagnant. That's one thing last year that uh, actually didn't even stay stagnant. It went negative. We ended up losing two locations, uh, just essentially due to the pandemic, uh, which was unfortunate. I haven't had the time and effort to replace those locations last year. So that's one thing this year that I'm gonna be going after. Now I'll make sure to do a, a more in-depth video on uh, the craziness with the ATM business last year. Actually, it wasn't too crazy. Uh, it definitely could have been worse, but losing two locations is unfortunate, um, especially in a pandemic because I want that revenue as well of those, uh, those ATMs. Now with the ATMs, I'm also fixing a friend of mine's ATM. Shout out uh, to John out there at ATM Central for uh, helping out with this weird situation that we're dealing with the, with the ATM. Couldn't have done it without you. Thank you guys. And my goal, honestly, is to uh, get five new locations in the first quarter of this year, which is a lofty goal, but I think it's achievable. And I definitely know it's something I can if I put that time and effort to. Which goes on to the big news. I have quit. I've decided to take a break from the hospitality industry. Yes, after two and a half years at, at these properties, uh, honestly, they are my babies. Um, even helped uh, open one, which was great. Um, it's time for a little bit of a break for me. I'm really gonna be pushing the ATM business a lot more uh, in lieu of working full time with the hotels. I'm still gonna be helping out since they are my babies. Uh, I won't be too far, but it just won't be my nine to five uh, that I traditionally have. Hit that subscribe button for me, hit that bell notification, leave some comments. I'm sure I've been out for a year. Hopefully you guys are happy to see me back. And uh, if you guys have questions throughout the year, write those questions down there. I'll make sure to respond. If I get enough of the same question, I might even do a video on it. Also, if you guys have any questions that may want a video to, write that down below. I'll see if I can get a video for you. I hope you guys have the best day, whatever day it is for you. Enjoy it, but keep grinding every day like it's Monday. See y'all later.